Hello and today we're back today we're back inside of Roblox Minecraft for a brand new video. And inside of today's video, I'm gonna be bringing you all redacted R U C L B six layout. So let's get right into the stats. So for the stats of R U C L V six, we have four hundred and fifty million to six hundred and six hundred and fifty million in cash per hour, which you know that's the money you make. And then we got between 7,400 and 15,500 customers per hour, which is insane. Now that we got everything else out of the way, let's go ahead and get in. Oh, oh my bad. <laughs> let's go ahead and get right in to making floor one. So this is going to be a 10 floor layout as usual. And uh, as usual, or not as usual, well, yeah, as usual pretty much. This is a bigger restaurant game pass layout. You guys cannot make this without the bigger restaurant game pass. So don't even try. Just please don't even try. I don't want y'all to waste your time. But anyways, we have more layouts coming out tomorrow. So let's get right into creating the layout. So we got right here in the corner. We're going to start with our, um, obviously with our, we're going to use the core. We got the core starting off first. So we're going to go with our haunted coffins. You guys can use any decor item you want. So we can go up two, just like this. Okay, I got to turn my sound on. Thank you. Up two, just like this. Going all the way up. Actually, not all the way up. So we're going to go about right here. So we're going to go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Up eleven on the second row right here. It's going to be an empty slot. And then we have two right here on the... 13th slot is going to, or 13th uh, row right here, it's going to be an empty slot. Just place it right there, and boom, there we go. Now we're going to go into our Christmas trees, which we got right here, and this is going to be a point of rotation right here. Boom, just like that. Now, I'm going to use the new inverted table, because I'm going to be keeping this layout for a little bit. So I'm going to be going one, two, one, two just like that, and now we're going to be using corrupted now so we're gonna go finish around so we got one two three four five six seven eight chairs and then we're gonna use another christmas tree right here Hold on. right here this point of rotation boom i'm pretty sure hopefully i got that right yes i did get that right okay now we're gonna go ahead and use our haunted coffins again where are our haunted coffins at we're gonna go right here we're gonna go two all the way up just like this, going all the way to the very back, which would be 16, so that'd be 32 haunted coffins right there, or 32 decor items, depends on what y'all want. So, now right here, I'm actually going to go ahead and we got to turn off restaurant, and we got to turn off camera. So now we're going to go ahead and grab our tables, obviously inverted set, we're going to use an inverted table, and then for the corrupted royal, we're going to use just corrupted, a corrupted set, so we're going to go uh four tables across now we're gonna have two chairs going up one two and then all the rest of these chairs are going to be connected on to these tables right here and then now we're going to two up to the back again now over here we have a table two chairs one two three empty slots two chairs two empty slots a table and a chair right here in this little slot you guys want to put on, uh, oh, we're going to put down a random decor item. I'm going to put down Haunt the Coffin because Haunt the Coffins boost the chance of Headless Horseman. So, now we're going to go ahead and use uh, two, chair, two chairs. We're going to go one, two, and then another chair. Two tables. One, two. A, ta a chair on the set. A chair right here on this set. Or right, two sets right here. Two chairs in the back. And then one facing the front. We go, but now we have a chair facing to the side on the table. So we have a chair, uh, you know, the table right here, another chair, and then a uh, table. All right, two more chairs right here. We're gonna have a luxury uh, silver tray. Now we're gonna have, oh, pick this up. Now we're gonna have two more chairs. We're gonna go one, two. We have another luxury silver tray, and then we have two more chairs. And now, right here on the very back of these of this these two tables right here, point of rotation for this Christmas tree 
is going to be right here. Boom, just like that. And I want to clear something up real quick. You guys can use any two by one tables you guys want to. It does not have to be a corrupted royal or inverted royal or regular royal. You know, but to get the stats, you guys definitely want to be using corrupted, at least corrupted royal and, or um, regular royal. But I don't know how much you can make with this invert, new inverted royal set. So that's going to be very OP to find out. And I actually do want to find that out. And you guys don't, you guys do not have to use the uh, luxury silver trays. Luxury silver trays are just a lot better if you guys have them. But if you guys don't have them, it is perfectly a okay. It's not going to harm you that much. Just use a regular one. And the Christmas trees, you guys need Christmas trees. But because without them, you guys lose double the profit of anything that's placed down. But if you guys don't have them, just replace them with either regular silver tray or just the decor item, filler item, anything. So, the rest of the floor, or actually I can't just say the rest of the floor is going to be decor because we have some empty slots. So now, from this table up, we're going to go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 12, all, basically just all the way to the back. So yeah, now from this t chair, we're going to go 1, 2, 2 empty slots, uh, haunted coffin, empty slot, 3 more haunted coffins, and then now the rest of the floor is pretty much just, no, not pretty much. It, the rest of the floor is literally just me placing down some decor items. So I'm going to see you all on floor two. Now we're on floor two, which is going to be the kitchen floor. So let's get right into it. So we are going to need to place down either sapphire or ruby uh, dishwashers right here. So we're going to go one, two, just like that. Now right here, we have an empty slot. And then right here, you guys can barely see it because my teleport is messed up and not right here. It's right there in the corner. So now we have silver tray just like that. The empty slot. And now we're gonna have two chairs. So we're gonna go one, two, table. We have two more uh, chairs right there. There we go. Boom. We got one set right here. Now we're gonna go one, two, three, four from the silver tray. Two tables. Four chairs. And then right here, we're gonna have a golden order stand at the end of this uh, chair right or the row of chairs right here. And we got the point of rotation Christmas tree of the Christmas tree is going to be obviously facing boom, the uh, set. And now we're going to have our decor items. So I'm going to go ahead and make and do it how I did it to make it very easy. We're going to go ahead and just grab our haunted coffins. We're going to go ahead and go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Right there. Over here, we're just going to fill this in right here. Right, just like that. Now we're going to go one, two. Three, four, five, six. Now we're gonna grab our stoves. I'm gonna use a ruby. I'm gonna go one. Now I'm gonna use sapphire. I'm gonna go two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Boom. Just like that to make a square. And then we obviously, you guys know that we have an empty slot in the middle. And then now the rest of the floor is just me going to be placing the core items. It can be literally any decor item. It does not have to be a haunted well or haunted coffins. It can be ex it can be like a statue, VIP player statue. It can be roses. It can literally be anything. So, but you want to fill the entire floor in with um, with the core items. So, I will see you all on floors three through ten. Now we're on floors three through ten. So let's get go ahead and get right into it. So I have two chairs, one two table. Two more chairs one two just like that now we're gonna have a coffee machine right here uh work my coffee machine's up we're gonna have a coffee machine right here then we're gonna go ahead and have a silver tray boom now we're gonna go ahead and have uh two sets right here of uh corrupted royal one two three four just like that four chairs and eight chairs and two tables pretty much now we're gonna go ahead and place down our christmas tree Point of rotation is going to be right here. Boom, just like that. Now we're gonna go ahead. Hold on, make sure I didn't miss anything. Well, yeah, 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 we're good. Okay, now we're gonna go ahead and place down, you know, our uh, four chairs on each side, just like this. Now we're gonna have two tables. Boom, boom. Now we have four more chairs. Two empty slots right here, and then we're gonna go one, two, and then a table. And then 
two more chairs, boom, just like that. Now we're going to go ahead, grab our haunted coffins, our haunted wishing wells again. Now we're going to go only two out this time. I don't know why it's only two out. Maybe it's a bug or whatever that they messed up. But you're only going to go two out instead of three out. And then, boom, there you go. Now you guys are clear to open your restaurant and start serving some customers. But you do want to make sure you guys repeat this floor right here from all from floors three through ten. So I'd be on floor three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and then ten. Yeah, you're gonna want to have this layout on. So that is pretty much all we got for today's video. So hope you all enjoyed. Please make sure to subscribe, like, and notification. I'll see you in the next video. Hope you all enjoyed and peace out. <laughs>